we had each other. That's a good thing. God was looking out for us. We feel real lucky. We have God on our side. It was around 8 o'clock Saturday night when Johnny Tarter heard the dogs barking outside. And well, the first time I come out, I didn't see nothing. They barked again. When Tarter came out the second time, he saw flames outside the mobile home he shares with his 71-year-old mother and siblings. Told him to get everybody out of the house. The house is on fire, and that's when the flames started coming through the, through the kitchen, through the kitchen wall, and that's when everybody got out. The Radcliffe Fire Chief says extension cords running out of the mobile home were powering a space heater inside a tent. The chief says the heater started the fire. My brother lost all his clothes. Everything, everything he had, we lost everything we had. I just feel so bad, you know, uh, she's a older lady, just, you know, and everything she had is in there. Kelvon Love saw the flames across the street and knew he had to help. It was bright. It was very bright, very hot. And I mean, within minutes, it seems like that you can tell the temperature changed real quick. Love says the fire department got there quickly. The chief says it didn't take long for the 20 firefighters to get the flames under control. They had like several trucks here. They, they, they jumped into action. They did their best to kind of save what she had. But it's a trailer. It went up like a matchstick. The family tells me they're looking for another place to live and help rebuilding their home. In Radcliffe, Emily Maha, WLKY News.